Hey guys, it's for Smith, and this is a review on iExplorer, the um, the um, app that lets you connect to servers and um, other devices. You can use this to share um, photos either from your iPad or from a from your PC or other servers. Like, say, if you want to add a add a photo from your PC to your um, server on here you can do so right. I've got my one on here it will load up <coughs> it takes its time but oh there we are um, now I usually add more stuff than this I don't know what happened but this is all it's got but it's still good because I can still do the review now all this is on my computer. I I set it up. I show you how to do it, and you got all the documents, downloads, music, and pictures from your device. So let's just go to pictures, sample pictures, and let's just go to that. Um, so basically, this is one of the sample pictures from my computer. Now then, if you want, you can press that button. Or you can tweet it, print it, or save it to photos album. So let's just go save the photos album. Saved. And there we got all the um, other pictures. If you want, you can press edit. You can select as many as you like. You can press that button. <clears throat> and then you can either copy it to other folders like say copy it to there and you can click done transfer tasks are complete and then that's saved onto your um, local folder on here or what you could do let's just do that you could import photos or delete them move them create text, put them in a zip file and so on um, but hang on a minute, if we deselect that one you've got a new option, transfer by bluetooth now um, this app is not supposed to be for iPad, the only reason I'm doing it for iPad because it's the only device I've got that this camera can actually focus on correctly, in other words it's big enough for it um, but if you've got an iPhone you can send it to other Bluetooth devices like say if you've got Bluetooth on your computer you can send it to that or Bluetooth on another iPhone um, I tried it last night but unfortunately the Bluetooth on this wasn't that good but if you're doing it from an iPhone or a 4S it'll be excellent for it you can email it to people and this applies for like all um for all the um, things on here like sounds, music, documents, bluetooth, everything it's, it's a very handy app to use <coughs> just gonna delete that now let's go back it's got documents which you've got nothing on there because there's nothing on local on my PC got music which is just a sample music Again, it's got nothing on there because for some reason it had it, but it lost it. I don't know why. Uh, let's go back to the beginning. Uh, this is local, and as you can see, this is actually on the app itself. And as you can see, it's got all the um, pictures and all that. Um, if you click up here, you can add servers. You can manually or find find one from a LAN. This is what I've done to add my um, PC. Basically, you've got a search LAN and it will find it straight away, or it should do. Or you can manually add it. And do it again. Cloud servers. Now then, this was a little bit difficult because all these servers, some of them need passwords like CloudMing. And it needs a username and password. So
Oh yeah, I've, I've already had it, but the only problem is... <coughs> I wasn't quite sure my password for it, so... Can't, can't really be done after. So I'm out of there because it froze, don't know why. Yeah, sorry about this, it keeps on freezing. Got no idea why. Um, anyway, while it's hopefully fixing itself, I, I actually showed you most of it can do. Um, so basically, quick, quick recap, if you connect it up to a server, you can share files from and to that server. You can actually put files onto, onto it and um, send it away from it. Like, say, like I've done there with the picture, I managed to get that from my computer and store it on the actual iPad itself. It is extremely handy um, on the go. It, like, if you've got a 3G iPhone 4 or 4S and you want to connect to the... Um, connect to your PC at home then it is an excellent choice no I do not this has not happened to me before um, it froze up I don't know why but luckily I'm cleaning up on the review now so yeah you can you, you can email the um, pictures from your PC like okay let's give you an example if you want right if if you forgot to put a picture onto a iPod <clears throat> or iPhone or 4S and you want to show it to someone like your boss or your manager or so someone like that you can use this to connect to your server at home take it from your server at home and then email it to the person that wants it it's extremely easy for that or well, you can Bluetooth it to them from your phone um, anyway I hope you found this informative this was um Oh yeah, prices, forgot about that. Um, iExplorer, uh, 499 US dollars. Um, it is quite cheap, quite reasonable for what it does. So yeah, I'd, I'd recommend it. It's quite easy app to use. And I'll think that is it. So, hope you like it. Please rate, subscribe, and uh, if you want to favourite this video, I really appreciate it. And I'll see you next time. So until then, see you guys.